we've been telling you how the flu season is brutal this year. And with the virus still running rampant, some people are considering getting a second flu shot. Valley News team's Joseph Ojo is here to tell us what experts are saying about two shots versus one. Joseph? Good evening, Andrea. While doctors have heard of this, they don't recommend anyone getting a second flu shot. The one time it is necessary, though, is for younger kids who may, have, who may be getting the vaccine for the first time. It is no secret that people worry about getting the flu. And those who worry get their flu shot early in the season. Fearing one dosage of the vaccine may not cover them throughout the flu season, people may consider getting a second flu shot. For adults, it never has been that you get two flu shots within the season. Um, the immunity is taken with that first immunization and you aren't going to get any added benefit from it. Health expert Joanne Alman says a second vaccine for an individual who has had a flu shot before can affect the immune system. A second shot can also interfere with the antibodies your body has built up after the first vaccine. Due to that reason, for example, the elderly, they get a high, what we call a high dose vaccine because their immune system isn't as good at forming antibodies. The only time a second shot is recommended is for kids under the age of eight who have never had the vaccine before. The first time. So, for example, if a baby comes in and gets their first flu shot at age six months, then they would get the booster at 28 days. With the total number of flu cases decreasing slightly, doctors do warn that you still get the immunization if you have not. By getting your flu shot every year, over time you build up your overall immunity to influenza. So if you were to get the flu shot this March, the next time you would get your flu shot for the next season would be in the fall. Andrea, back to you. All right. Thank you so much, Joseph. Okay, basketball tonight.